Hello my friends and welcome to episode 41 of Battletech's Eye. It's Grave Robbing Part 2 and I have a glass of water. <clears throat> Believe it or not, I've decided to demote myself from fizzy drink for one day. I hereby command you to- oh shit. <laughs> For the reach. Just a heads up. When we get to a safe distance, I'm gonna set off a little surprise I left behind for our Torian friends. Surprise. Surprise. You'll see. Trust me. You're gonna love it. So of course my dudes are just sat here with no defense. Hey, stop damaging my highlighter. My highlighter? My highlander. My armor's melting off. I get to keep that one. Oof. I might take penetrating damage before I even get a chance to move. I was pretty sure that you started with your defenses up and braced in this mission, but okay. minimal Okay Pink Recording minimal damage There's a pink ejection button Ha. Huh. Ready for orders. They disabled ejection on I think they tried to disable ejection on all of them. Although it still seems to work for the Black Knight. Maybe as a partial fix to the free salvage bug. Right, let's just try and kill him, shall we? Oh, ho, ho, oh, get some. I'm listening. <laughs> she hasn't got any, uh, they put the LBX-10 into this mech. They actually changed it in the plot, but in Zai it doesn't have the, uh, the ammo's not there. I've got standard AC-10 ammo. But I can't seem to change the firing mode to fire it. I can fire LC, MC, and TC, but I can't seem to actually fire the AC-10 ammo I have. Well, that's a problem that's going to come back and haunt us later. In the final mission. Some punishment. Pierced through the armor. Good to go. 
Man, what is with your weapon? Why is it? S why are all your guns so inaccurate? He's got a gunnery of eight. What is the problem with this shot? Okay, getting a bit closer actually seems to change the math totally. Let's go with B. Engaging multiple targets. Nice! Of course I knew he was so badly damaged. Now that hit something good. Oh, that's weird. I meant to fire the lasers at the uh at the fire star. It didn't seem to I'm here. work out that way. Roger. Okay, that's fine. Okay, apparently that's a bad shot. Okay, I'm on it. Nice. Ruined. Destroyed. Right, let's clean up these bugs as quickly as possible. And then head to the real extraction, which you know is over here. Of all the mechs to use your flamers on, you pick the one that's like heat neutral. Dun 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 They don't get uh They don't get infinitely respawning dudes or anything, so you uh You have all the opportunity in the world to take these boys down. Man, this Highlander is getting pounded. I think I'll have to jump him. I've got a bandit on my screen. Armor holding. Is that a tank? remember there being this many enemies, but it's been a long time since I've played this mission, so. Tell me what you need. Yes, what I need right now I'll make it happen. is a dead shadow hawk. And for you to adjust your angle so you're not such an easy target. I'll do what you ask. Oof. The accuracy on the old Disco Fever guns. Receiving you. It's impressive. Roger that. Flush. Ah. Uh. Die. Targeting for an alpha strike. Oh, so much punishment. Oh, how are you still alive? Reporting critical hit. Aye, aye. I 
the Highlander can jump, but this one can't really get a good angle. And this gorse rifle has a serious minimum range problem. Confirmed. Okay. Oh, you're not allowed to eject these guys. Maybe that also prevents the cheese that I did the first time I did this in the AC2 campaign. Which was to simply run Chimera here. And then eject the other three mechs for an instant win. Because that's another thing. <laughs> Ugh, that wasn't good. You know, for 50%, I sure as hell didn't land any shots there. We go. That went a little bit better. Eighty percent, huh? Take that. Oh well, whatever. It's two more enemies down. I must admit, I don't like being the wrong end of the initiative table. I've forgotten what it feels like after all these lights only campaigns. Oh, the Jenna ran away. So, so much fear. <laughs> oh, I could lose here if he headshots. But he didn't. He did hit me, though. They slacked my armor. I love the Black Knight, it's a monster. It's so accurate. The targeting computer is real. Although it doesn't seem to. Oh, it's got four heat sinks in the legs, okay. It doesn't seem to have. Uh any targeting computer that I can see. Stripping armor off of my mech. Standing by. This is my damaged Highlander. Whatever, I'm good. Let's start the proceedings. Copy that. Go. Attacking from position. Jesus. Got past the armor. This guy is clinging to life. No, dead. <laughs> Loud and clear. Clinging to life, pilot incapacitated. Oh, okay, maybe not. Waiting for orders. Ready for orders. Confirm. Fire. Target confirmed. What the hell did that gorse rifle round explode on? It just seemed to blow up in the air. You have my attention. Oh wow, this enforcer has not moved. Yeah, that's the only shot I have. Let's just make it a standard shot. Go! Copy that. Orders. 
I'm going to precision strike here to amp up the accuracy. Oh, nasty hit. And he's gone. That's a kill. Nice work from the blackjack there. And the ghost rifle's got a really nasty minimum range. On a weapon that I don't actually feel is that great. Reporting. Heavy damage. It's jammed. Hey, at least it works. My AC-10 apparently has got the wrong ammunition. My mech is losing internal structure. Arm Hybrid Plus. Wow, melee attack does 140 damage more. 210 damage on a melee, nasty. Left arm. I need to start rotating. Location confirmed. To hide my damaged right arm. Get some. Oof. What a pummeling. Commander. Right, we don't want to get too close. I don't want to trigger the next phase of this mission. Coordinates received. We just kill him and then waddle our way to the exit. I'll use the fastest mech I have to go over here to trigger the next bit. Can also take the opportunity to cool that cool down a little bit. Okay. Standing by. Lots of hits. No serious damage. Confirmed. Oh, nice. That hit exactly where it needed to. Hostile removed. Receiving you. And that just leaves the Highlander. Locking in all weapons. Oh, nice hit. You ain't gonna do much with a jammed weapon. I don't hold out much hope for the tanks either. But we have been fighting non stop here for quite a bit. Most of the damage we took was right at the bloody start. How the hell did you hit the arm from there? Heavy damage. I don't actually understand how he hit the arm from that from that angle, but whatever. I'm reserving. Seventy fifty-five. It feels to me like this gorse rifle has a really weird sweet spot. Roger. Might as well put these back on. Acknowledge. Oh, nice hit. Scored a critical hit. How's it going? On the move. Alright. I know what I must do. 
One shot ghost rifles. Multiple enemies locked in. Nice. Oh, it's a miss. Negative damage. Order. How could you fail us? You were the chosen one. Affirmative. Engaging. Ooh, that hurt. Oh, he's done. He's donezo. Get out. Hostile removed. All the Oregon people. I'm on my way. Engaging hostile. He hasn't got much armor, so he should just die. Bit like that, really. Enemy vehicle down. Torrent casualties were high today. Tell me what you need. What I need is for you to start sprinting your unbelievably slow ass to eBay. I'm here. Roger. Meanwhile, the striker in an awkward position can be Receiving you. bombarded. Might well, just stand by. Run, Lady Arano. Run as far as you can. I will find you all the same. <laughs> the funny part is, he starts bragging away. I'm showing my this is a bug about this mission. I'm listening. He starts bragging away as you Copy run towards an evac me. that you don't even know about yet. Kind of funny. Standing by. Acknowledged. Okay. I just wanted to have a look around on this map. You very rarely get to see this map, since it's just for this one mission. Firing. Yes, Commander. Oh, I am allowed. Yeah. Need something to I'm allowed to eject them all now. Sweet. Oh no, not the Highlander. Standing by. Hey there. I don't know which of these mechs I consider to be the Wait fastest one. I think it's the Black Knight. Roger. Go! Nice. Pretty sure he's dead. Reporting enemy vehicle eliminated. Aye aye. Confirmed. Affirmative. Aye aye. Aye copy. Yeah, just move forward slightly until you trigger the next bit. Boom! Boom! <laughs> yeah, they were shooting at us, remember? Assignment so I can have the pleasure of hunting you down. 
when I catch you, I will make you pay for the death of my son. <laughs> He's saying that, and uh, he hasn't given us the speech yet. Standing by. The other speech. Let's move. Ready for orders. Let's go about here. He was under orders, he couldn't stand down. I'm on the move. Commander? No one cares. I'm here. Copy that. He died because he was a fool. It doesn't matter if you're under orders or not. <laughs> you you surrender in that situation. There's nothing else you can do. I, I don't think in this day and age any military would expect you to die rather than surrender in a situation where someone's literally got a gun pointed to your head. I'm moving out. Sure, if there's still some chance of victory. Position confirmed. What's up, boss? On my way. Acknowledged. Yes! Thank the gods you came. Now we're gonna die. <laughs> thank the gods you triggered the script that's gonna destroy us. I told you you would die here. Say goodbye to your ride home. Oh shit. Incoming! Oh look, the body stays there now. I think it just ra it just disappeared before. It just randomly disappeared. I think. How do you know about that? <laughs> this conversation's in the wrong order is hilarious. <laughs> Incoming assault mechs. Just another obstacle to overcome. For the restoration. For the restoration. You didn't really sound like you had much enthusiasm behind that, but okay. Standing by. Oh yeah, I should have ejected the Black Knight. That was dumb of me. Can't do it now. Ready we'll have to hold on for a turn. Lifting off. Oh, this is a move phase anyway, so no one can do anything. Although, if you move, you can shoot, which is funny. I'm on it. Target confirmed. Oh yeah, how does it feel to just spawn in and be target practice, huh? Aye aye. It's what you did to me. On my way. Confirmed. Oh, I think he took another headshot, yeah. Got past the armor. I'm being flanked. That's fine, because as soon as I eject the Black Knight, I've won. I'm under heavy fire here. You have my attention. Headshot, headshot. Confirmed. Oh, I didn't get the head. Pierced through the armor. He's got three wounds, though. I hate these guys. You know what? I'm gonna reserve and just kill the, uh... Kill the Thunderbolt. Just to put pieces of it in the loot table.
Although they're saying about assault mechs, but I don't see any assault Jerry, mechs. Scratch my armor. I see two heavies and a medium. Where's the assaults? Yes, Commander. How's it going? They changed this mission though. They have tried to remove cheese. Maybe I am not able to just eject the black black knight and leave. Commander. Maybe I am. Only one way to find out. Yup, I can. <laughs> See ya. Mission successful. Ha, oh, what a weird ending. Done. Continue or select a unit to brace all remaining mechs. Huh. That was funny. Victory is mine. Dun dun dun. I could have stayed and farmed mech parts. I really like this SRM-6 and it's quite rare. Let's see what else is in here. I could have, you know, done some cheesy stuff killing my uh letting my highlanders be killed by ct destruction and then if you allow them to be killed with ct destruction then you uh can flood the loot table with double heat sinks for example there are a great many ways to cheese really nice salvage out of this mission but i decided against it that really kind of is a pretty serious exploit. It's all the rage at the moment though. People on Reddit showing their mech builds with loads of uh, modules and stuff in that you shouldn't be able to equip normally. If you're gonna do that, why not just mod the game? Why not just mod the game so that you have those items? You know what I mean? It's, I mean, it's the same, th it's effectively the same thing. You mad, bro. This isn't over, Lady Arano. I killed your dudes and got out. I will find you. And my son will be avenged. Pray that your uncle's soldiers reach you before I do. Yeah, you said that last time. Okay. We're in the, uh... We're in orbit around the planet where this guy is. Probably not the best idea, but okay. Oh, how convenient. Calling that a win. Ha! 
Okay. <laughs> we can't we can't get rid of it because we need it for Deus Ex Machina reasons later. Or uh, Deus Ex Machina reasons, depending on how you want to pronounce a word. That was used so long ago that no one actually really knows how it was pronounced. But hey. Hell, maybe it wasn't even pronounced either of those two ways. Maybe they just pronounced it totally differently. Norwegian has taught me that sounds are weird in, in, uh, in different languages. Boom. Delete it. <laughs> yeah, go for it. Blah 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 Oh yes. Yes, yes, I'm I'm well aware that we need to go somewhere else. Just give me give me the Highlander. Let's stand down the Vindicare. Yes, yes. Yeah, all right. I'm on it. Let's have a look at this beast of a machine. Okay. The Gorse Rival is hotter now. It generates more heat. And honestly, it's really heavy for the damage it does. That's okay. Because I have a better idea. Since my Ultra AC5 is already in use. Uh, let's just add a pair of tracking ones in there. I'll save the really accurate one for later. Ha, huh, this works out to be less heat than the Ghost Rifle too. It's actually just totally superior to the Ghost Rifle in every conceivable way. Nearly double the raw damage. Alright. What else do we want to do? This is going to be ranged fire support. That means SRMs are no good. Minus one ton in size, nine tons. Sweet, because the other LRM-20 was like 12 tons. I didn't want to touch a 12 ton LRM-20 with a barge pole. Uh, 
Um, standard medium lasers, we can definitely improve that. It's actually not enough ammunition, really, to feed that launcher. To be brutally fair. What I actually need is extra ammunition. Where's the old, uh... I thought I had a spare vertical TAS, but I guess I don't. Oh well, that's okay. These are not heavy. Uh, let's get a big range finder in here so we can see the things which we are going to bombard from a mile away, in fact. Uh, I don't know, the command console is quite heavy though. To be brutally fair, the command console is is pretty heavy. lower heat. Actually, that'll be fine. Let's put that back in there. Oh. Huh. I didn't know that. Okay. Alright, what we have here is a great long range fire support mech with a little bit of medium laser fun in case the enemy closes in. And frankly, primary long range weapons is like 12. It's, uh, 35. 41. 41 heat for the, for the primary weapons. So that actually gives us plenty of room to jump jet around and fire our main weapons constantly. Since I don't think jumping is gonna generate that much heat. Okay. I think I'm pretty happy with this. This would be a great fire support mech. I would be very tempted to put the command console into this. I'm not quite sure what I would shed to put it in. I could shed a jump jet. 
I don't know how much jump mobility I really need on a mech that's long range fire support. And if I pair, if I find a pair of Ultra AC5s, this thing is going to become a monster. But I'm quite content with the firepower it has. That'll do. I think this is an okay design. Ah, oh, can't have a Highlander quote in there. <laughs> the cannon design. <laughs> it's not a cannon design. It'll do. Logged and open. Shouldn't be too hard. Nice. Well, wow, that's a huge upgrade in capabilities for us. And I would definitely, definitely love to get my hands on a. Uh, pair of Ultra AC-5s. I'll happily downgrade the missile support for that. It seems to be loading contracts but doesn't know what to do. Or it's somehow broken. Okay, whatever. You're not supposed to be able to get contracts on this planet anyway. You're the sword of restoration. Yar har har. Oh, look at that. I can actually stop in in Torian space. Which is hilarious considering that they ate my guts. <laughs> Let's go to a three skull Torian world and see if we can do some Torian contracts. That would be, amuse me if it's possible. Those upgrades you asked for are, are online. Commander. Well, I got plenty of money to do whatever now. Oh, that's expensive. Sure thing. It'll take a bit, but we'll get it done. Well, I need it. I cannot proceed with any upgrades any big upgrades until that is done, including the, the high-end VR pod, which is what I want to help train my pilots into into uh, into fierce warriors who at least have all three of their abilities. That would be nice. Get our hands on coolant flush for everybody. Jump, 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 jump. I wrapped up that job. Jump, you asked for, Commander. Got a new financial report for you, Commander. I could strip that Ultra AC5 out of the Hunchback, but I feel like that's the heart and soul of that mech. I like it just the way it is. Hey, it's still not as OP as the ultra weapons in heavy metal. We've arrived at our destination, Commander. The weapons in heavy metal are really desperately OP. Huh. I have a lot of bits of a Black Knight, but according to this I have 0 out of 8. Must be a different version. Oh, An extended range medium laser. With plus 2 accuracy. Jesus Christ, they want some money for it though.
Oof. Minus 50% heat, plus 2 ton in size. You know what? That's actually a good launcher. To be fair. 9 heat is uh, 3 tons worth of heat, although against double heat sinks it's less. Obviously. But on a stalker that could work out quite nicely. If you're trying to avoid paying for heat sinks. Or at least pay less for them. Aha! Finally found the items that make melee viable. Nice. But, anyway, this is a Torian planet and they hate me. Costs are high. Let's see if we can please them by doing some contracts. I'll come in here now and I'll find only Arano contracts and I'll be like, ooh. In theory, what I should find is lots of Torian against pirates. Has the contract system died? No. <laughs> it's designed in such a way that you are not allowed to get Torian contracts. So instead, it's uh, it's missions for pirates. Great. I'd love to improve my pirate reputation. Who knows, maybe I'll get the black market if I get them to like me enough. I'm honestly not that far away from uh, getting them to like me again. Alright, well there's plenty to do on this planet. But it looks like repairing my uh, Tauren rep reputation is not a thing that's going to happen. So, that is it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys next time. And I'll seriously consider whether I want to buy any of the items in the store. But, yeech. They're lovely items, but my god the cost. Anyway, see ya.